Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, it's Jude from Happiness and Crafting. So today I'm just going to show you quickly what I'm up to. Um, I'm making these um, pads of paper, these little notebooks for a friend of mine. So I thought I would turn my camera on and show you how I am doing it. It's really, really simple and easy. Um, because I can upload videos a lot, lot quicker, you will probably get a lot more now. So all as I've done, I've taken my backing papers, which are the Halloween ones. Um, but again you can use any papers you like because I've used them on here as well which were my collage papers so I think these notebooks look really really lovely and it's a quick easy um, gift idea so these are fantastic and I've also covered some pencils with some skull paper so I'll show you how simple that is as well um, so what I'm using I have these little pads of paper so it's almost like a cheats way these were 55 cents and they're A5 um, papers and I think there's about 40 sheets in here um, or 80 sort of like doubled over so what I've done I've just taken half of the pad um, because it fits the paper a lot lot better because this is I printed this out on A4 paper um, so when you fold it over it will fit the paper properly without doing any cutting or any tidying up it's just super simple now I've printed um, on both sides so we've got the lovely um, bats on there and then I've just got the black and white one that I've got I've got a black and white Halloween set which is a really easy lovely one so if you've only got a black and white printer it's absolutely perfect and I've got some skeletons on there um, this one here I've got some skulls and scorpions and snakes and spiders and then we've got spiders inside so these are super simple and a really good gift and then I've got the pencils as well so what I'm going to do I'll pop that to the side I've got this one which I'm going to show you which has got the skulls on one side and the spiders on the other well all as I've done I've just folded it in half um, I've taken half I've all as I did I took the paper clips out of here and taken and I've taken the um, cover off but if, if you didn't want to do that you could stick the paper onto the cover even easier but I thought I would just take it off um, and do it that way so all as I've done I've taken half of the paper folded that in half and there we go made a cover and I'm just going to staple it together with my stapler so super easy little project um, so I'm just going to pop that in there get my um, rubber like that pop these in like we've done before and then we just make sure we staple it in the right place like that through there and again on this side pop the rubber underneath pop your paper on top and then roughly so just open up your staple your stapler like that and then all you do is put something soft underneath just so your stapler can stick into it um, and it's super easy and then uh, if you've got it straight I hope I've got it straight take something and just bend the staples over like that and then just fold it up and there we go one easy little notebook so that's how easy it is to change the cover so I thought I would just show you quickly so then I have this lovely set of three um, I'm going to do another pencil so I'll show you how I've done that and this one has got little skulls on like this now I've printed this paper on 250 GSM 250 gsm paper i don't know what that is in pounds um, but the, this one here i've just printed it onto really cheap copy paper it's probably about 80 gsm or something like that 70 or 80 it's just a cheap one that i have and then i just brought this pack of pencils where they've got little rubbers on the end here um, and all i'm going to do I'm going to cut a section off because it's on cheap paper because you want to bend it around the pencil um, and you don't want the thicker paper because it just doesn't bend so I'm going to take a section off like that I'm going to just measure it so I'm measuring it from this bit here so we can wrap it round 
to sort of like the end of here so it's just above his eyeballs there so let's just cut that off so that should be like the right length yes so now what I'm going to do I'm going to take my tacky glue just glue down one side here right to the edge make sure you're right up to the edge just like this so all of these would be lovely if you had a lovely Christmas paper um, would be nice and you can make Christmas um, little gifts so I'm just going to stick that onto there um, and then pop it on just squeeze it down push it down like that so it sticks nicely make sure you're sort of level so it goes around the pencil properly and then all as I'm going to do I'm going to roll it first just to get it look at that and then I'm going to glue the rest so I'm going to just get some glue right in under there I want to make sure it's all glued down properly I'm just using tacky glue on here um, because it's just a paper and this is sort of like wood so it sticks really well so make sure you've got a nice lot on there right up to this edge here so we don't have a little gap pop that on and then all as I'm going to do again is roll that make sure you pull it tight and then just roll it like that and push that down at the end so again you can use whatever papers you like but look at that how easy is that and it looks really really good so you've got a set of three pencils and a set of three books so they are ready for my friend and her daughters um, for a little Halloween gift and I think that's super simple super easy and all as it does we did a little bit of a cheat which is just buy a little pad of paper which is really inexpensive because it's 55 cents um, and it's super easy and quick so there we go guys another quick easy one for you um, just a great one for um, gifts isn't it if you've got a little gift that you need to do straight away and again do it in any papers that you've got but I do suggest that you sort of like double print so print on the other side as well and the thicker the paper the better for your print for that your printer it can take your printer can take if I can get that out because then the covers are normally a little bit thicker um, and they look really really good so there we go guys quick little project for you um, thank you so much for joining me please take care stay safe and I will see you soon all right guys bye bye